This is the Ask Coach Kathy segment where you get to write in questions and I answer them on the air anonymously. This week's question is, Kathy, my husband and I give our kids an allowance each week for chores they do around the house, but they are forever asking us for more money because they seem to spend whatever they make. I wish we could teach them how to budget their allowance, but I don't know how. Do you have any ideas? Well, I don't, but I have a couple here who does. I'd like to introduce Karen and Rod Ott. Rod Ott to the show. Welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Now, Thanks you have three kids, ages yeah. eight, 13, and 15. And because of the different ages, I'm guessing you give different kinds of allowances. Is that true? We do. We okay. do. We sat down and decided that the older two, since they're teenagers, and they want to do and need to do more things with their friends, and uh, so we decided to, um, to give them $10 a week. Okay. And then our eight-year-old, we decided to give her $5 a week. And how did they feel about that when you shared that info? Were they okay with that? All except for the eight-year-old. <laughs> Because she wanted to be like the she older kid. She wanted to be like the older Why don't yeah. I get ten dollars? But yeah. so. so, how do you? This is advice that I want you to give the viewer. They feel like an ATM machine, right? I mean, how do you prevent that from happening? That's exactly how we felt. Our our girls love to do, you know, go to the movies and go out to dinner with their friends, and we um, we decided that they needed to be a little more responsible around the house. And so we thought, well, if we have them do a few more chores around the house and uh -huh. then they would earn this allowance, which we don't call allowance, we call it their entertainment money. Okay. So they, uh, they do their little chores. We have our little chore chart. Yes, yeah, you brought it. We brought a little cool. example. This isn't our actual one because it's way too neat. Oh, okay. <laughs> so explain this. Let's but this is, this is just our chore chart. And it's just basic you know, things that they need to do every day anyway. Make beds, <laughs> do dishes, tidy up. And the That's older great. two help me sweep and dust. And our youngest, she sets and clears the table. But every day, they're accountable to do those things, and then they are checking these off every day. Okay, and if they do them, then they get their allowance. If or they, they get their yes, entertainment if they money. do, if they do everything, they get their ten dollars or five dollars at the end of the What week. happens though is if they get it and it runs out, and they come to you and say, "Up, oh, I ran out. Can I have some more?" What do you do about that? There's uh, no advances. There's no. Uh, when it's done, it's yeah, done? There's no extra chores they can do. That's what they get per week, and they have to budget it for something Love further it. down the road. Love it. And Rod actually had the, the great <coughs> idea to use our, um, our bank check register. And the girls each have their own register, and they, um, they write in their you know, $10 at the beginning of the week. And then and it's, it actually, it's worked out really neat. And I haven't even had to like say anything, but our, our middle daughter loves to go to the basketball games at school and it costs a dollar. But uh -huh. she still, she still you know, writes it in and subtracts oh, her dollar. And, and she's learning the check register. So she's learning right. that. and it's, it's holding them accountable for every penny they spend. That way they can't come to us and say, well, somebody took my money or... Right. Where did right. money go? It's, exactly. It's right. their choice as to whether they use it right. or not. Right. Yeah, what know exactly great, where it goes. Oh, great right. life skills early on so when they can become adults and someday have a credit card or don't have a credit card, they can figure right. out their own budget. Exactly. Fab I applaud you. Oh. Thank, you. <laughs> well, thank, thank you. you so much for coming out thank and you sharing your experience. Us. Thank you. It's great. And thank you for, for tuning in to Can You Relate again this week. I want you to stay tuned for next week because we're going to be talking about photo albums and how photo albums can actually enhance your relationship with the people you love. So stay tuned. We'll be back next week. Wardrobe provided by Aurora Farms Premium Outlets. Hair and makeup courtesy of John Roberts Salon and Spa. Want to learn more about today's topics, suggest segments, or add your input? You can do all this and more at CanYouRelateTV.com. Can You Relate with Kathy Dawson is presented by CK Media Productions.